हेलो फ्रेंड्स एंड चैंपियन में ही पावर सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट एक्सेप्शन विद द हेल्प ऑफ एग्जांपल सो हियर आई हैव क्रिएटेड वन क्लास क्लास एक्स व्हिच कंटेन्स द मेन फंक्शन एंड इन दिस आई हैव यूज्ड थ्री वेरिएबल्स ऑफ इंटीजर टाइप वन इज आई second is d which is initialized with 10 and third is r okay then as we know exception occur at the run time so we need to put the statements which may cause exception in the try block the statements which are expected to cause exception are need to be put in the try block okay now i am using the try no parenthesis after this you have to just start the curly braces and then in the try block i am using loop in the loop i am initializing value of i with 5 and running the loop till the value of i is greater than minus 5 and decrementing the value of i in every iteration then performing this function performing this statement divide the d by i i have put this statement this statement in the try block as when d will be divided by 0 when the value of i becomes 0 it will throw exception and then just writing the value of r then after the try block you have to write the catch block which will caught the exception okay so it is must to create the catch after the try otherwise it will show error you can create multiple catch blocks okay so by, uh, for creating the catch you have to just write the ca keyword catch and in the parenthesis you have to write the name of the class which may caught the exception here this is this will cause arithmetic exception so i am writing arithmetic exception e this object will be created of the arithmetic exception when the exception is caused and it will write exception caught in one and after this i am creating another catch if there may be another error which is not caught by this will come here this is exception class which is the parent class of all the exception it can catch all the exceptions which can be of other type and it will write exception caught in two this catch block must be written at the end of the all the other catch blocks because it will catch all the exception if it is written first then it will catch the exception and handle it and no other catch block will be checked because the catch blocks are checked in this sequence then in the end i have just written end of the program in this system dot out dot println to check whether our program is executing or running or ending properly okay so now we need to compile this to check whether our program is running successfully or not i have saved this with ex exception ex dot java in the g dot java folder so for compiling this exception ex dot java it is compiled with no error for running this we have to need exception ex this is the result what does this result how this result come first for i is equal to 5 10 divided by 5 gives 2 4 divided by 5 gives 2.5 in the integer it is 2 then 3 by 10 gives 3.3 which returns then 10 by 2 which returns 5 then 10 by 1 which returns 10 then in the zero exception will be thrown and it will be caught by the arithmetic exception return exception caught in one exception caught in 
वन ओके सो दिस शोज दैट आवर एक्सेप्शन इज कॉड इन दिस एंड देन एंड ऑफ प्रोग्राम इज रिटर्न दिस शोज आवर प्रोग्राम इज एक्सिक्यूटेड सक्सेसफुली सो दिस इज अबाउट द एक्सेप्शन थैंक यू वेरी मच